Hey guys, so welcome in the tutorial of SOLIDWORKS. So today we are going to see that how can you give ISO standard or ANSI standard dimensions on this model with the circular patterns. So with the whole patterns, we have the circular pattern and we have the linear pattern of holes. So how can we give dimension to the whole pattern we are going to see in this video. So I made this model, you can also made by your own dimensions if you have already uh, one model and we are going to see that how can you give a uh, standard dimension on that model so go to file click on new draw so we are going for drawing file because uh, a drawing file always required dimensions uh, the model doesn't require the dimension because if you want to if you want to uh, uh, model any any part you you, you will need this uh, drawing sheet and the dimension on it so that you can model from that drawing file so you have this part open now click on this uh, uh, arrow so you will get this I'm going for top view so you can see that I have placed the top view of that of that model so now we need to give the dimension for this you click on this you can scale this using scale options this is more this is fine 1 is to 50 and then you can drag it somewhere so that we can get it full view so now it's fine so go to annotation smart dimension so first of all let's define for this linear pattern for this you need to give dimension for this a uh, diameter first so that's 15.75 and then you require this dimension which is the distance from this and you require distance from this so we have given a sufficient dimension for this hole now we require this and this distance between each hole like this and then we require distance from two holes like this so for linear pattern all the dimension which are sufficient is defined but now we need to modify this so as you can see we have one two three four five holes so what you can do click on this if you click on this you can see here you can write before this move your cursor write 5 x like 5 times this diameter so we have 5 times this circle like this these holes are 5 times of this one so that's the one way and now for this you need to define like the, the spacing cross one two three four so how to do that so this this also works but in in standard in standard view in standard format you, you need to delete this write this is as four cross 39.37 and then you can put equal to whatever it's like this 157 point something which we got earlier make it in the parenthesis so this is the standard format which you need to follow to give dimensions in a proper manner so that's for the linear pattern now we are going to see for the circular pattern so for circular pattern it's it's again it's very similar to this click on smart dimension need to give di diameter for this move it a little bit here 
give diamond give diameter for this and now you can see there are six holes for this one so if you click here move your cursor right six cross times this so these are six cross this one so then another an another way to give dimension for this is go to smart dimension click on this and now after this you can write dash six holes so in this way you can give dimensions to the circular or uh, linear hole patterns so this is generally for hole patterns so if you like this video hit the like button and subscribe the channel wise man thank you